Oh, you know what? I, I don't know what I moved on for. I haven't done the three good things about feminism yet. Oh, did I even get to three on the Bible one? Let's see. No, I didn't. I only got to two on the Bible one. You see how eager I am to move on. It's like, fuck. All right, so good literary values, occasional good moral lessons. Um, there's nothing else. It all The rest of it just sucks. Uh, what about feminism? Well, feminism, um, it's at least inspired um, uh, girls, and I guess guys as well, to question gender norms in society. Um, it's interesting that... You know, it, you're allowed, you know, it's like we're, we're being told by feminists, you, these things need to be questioned, and then when men, or, or women, I guess, when, when, it, when anybody questions them in a way that feminists don't like, then it's like, oh, no, don't ask that question, you need to ask this question. It's like, no, all questions should be on the table. Any subject matter, all questions should be on the table, um, except for the ones that have already been answered. You know, unless there's a reason to revisit the question that we've already answered, and, and say, oh, well, let's look at this question again. I don't, I know, if, if there's a definitive, if there's a good answer, even if it's not a perfect answer, if there's a good answer, let's go with that until there's some reason to doubt it. Um, but, you know, I, I, I do like the fact that, it, it, that feminism has at least made that a conversation in our culture, even if they do try to censor one side of the conversation. No, not just one side, many sides of the conversation. Because it's not as nuanced as us versus them. I mean, it's more nuanced than us versus them. Fuck you, T. Fuck you, Scotty. Bitch. Um, more, more good things about feminism. Shit. Um, I mean, obvious, well, I don't know. It, it, it almost doesn't count what I'm about to say, but I mean... It, the original goals of feminism were perfectly just. Um, women want uh, voting rights. Women don't want to be discriminated against. Um, that, that's all perfectly fair and reasonable. I have no problem with any of that. But can you really even relate that? Can you even really draw a line from that to today's feminists who are all about you know, censorship of media that they don't like? Uh, who, who really, I mean, they ignore the plights of women in the third world. They ignore the plights of women in, well, I guess what you call the developing world at this point. Um, and that's all, well, whatever. You know, they, 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 there's societies where there's actual patriarchies, where the feminists of America just zip their lips, don't have a thing to say about it. But then when, you know, oh, these, these male gamers are playing this game where there's strippers. And then it's like, oh my goodness, we have to put a stop to that because it's objectifying women and it's so problematic and dangerous. And I was walking down the street and some man said hello to me and I didn't say anything back. And he's like, oh, what's your problem? And then I was so scared. I thought I was going to get raped. Ah! You know, it's, yeah, it's creepy, boring, trivial bullshit. Um... You know, I mean, it's, it's like I'm trying to compliment it, but I keep, my mind just keeps reverting back to the criticisms. And this is why I suck at finding common ground, because even if I find one good thing, I feel the need to insert about a trillion caveats. Oh, well, I guess you guys do this halfway right, but then you fuck up this, 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 and this, so it kind of doesn't even matter. It's all negated by, how you're, by your overall shittiness. And that's, you know, feminism, it's shitty. It's fucking shit. I mean, it doesn't matter. You, I mean, sure, you can cherry pick some good ideas out of it, just like the Bible. But uh, by and large, it's fucking useless as it exists today. Um, now, if 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 those uh, feminists on the internet gave up their crusade against video games and media portrayals and whatever other whiny bullshit they've got going on, and they actually focused on the real problems of women, both in America and in, you know, and in other countries, um, the, 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 you know, Occidental, Western civilizations and, you know, developing countries across the world, if, if they actually focused on the real plights... I could be a feminist? Sure, I would be a feminist. Why not? But they don't focus on real plights. 
You know, they don't care, oh, well, girls in Africa are uh, getting genitally mutilated, and uh, they actually do have a rape culture, and, you know, girl, women in the Congo, uh, because there's really no uh, strong central government, there's, you know, guerrillas everywhere, and they just rape women at will, and no one can stop them, and then you got... You know, uh, ISIS is taking women as sex slaves, and women in India are being subject to forced sterilizations, and women in India and China are, um, you know, they're if they if they get pregnant with a with a, a girl child, they they do back alley kind of abortion shit because they want their first child to be a male child, and male children are given a strong preference. Um, you know, I never see, I know, I don't, Anita Sarkeesian has never mentioned that shit. As far as I, I've ever paid attention to her, she's never mentioned any of that. She's been too busy whining because, you know, oh, this, this girl in this video game uh, showed her tits. Like, who fucking cares? Who, who possibly gives a shit about that trivial nonsense other than, than simpletons and just sort of simpering fucking halfwits. I mean, god damn. It's so trivial. It's so... I don't understand how you guys can call yourselves feminists with a straight face. You're not feminists. You're fucking... You're a joke. But that's what mainstream feminism is now. Uh, basically useless. <laughs>